Good morning and welcome to the Sick News Network. It is Tasty Tuesday, January 15th. Now for your weather. For your weather today, the high is 36 and the low is 25. Tomorrow is looking sunny and so is Wednesday, but Thursday is looking kind of rainy, so make sure you bring a jacket or umbrella. That's all for your weather. Now to your lunchtime meetings. And now for your lunchtime meetings. Tuesday will be FCA Bible study. Wednesday is math club. Thursday is FCCLA. And Friday is FCA. Let's go to the corner school announcements. Make sure if you want to participate in the Tri Lakes Community Health Center visit, you need to turn in your completed forms to the office by January 25th. Here's your homecoming information. Each class should meet with the sponsors to determine how they want to decorate the area in the comments and the look of, for the banner of the gym. Students may stay after school until 5 p.m. starting today until the 23rd to work on these decorations. Each sponsor has a paper with the rules and the decorations. Spirit Week will be starting next Tuesday, so start preparing your outfits. I already have a few of mine. How about you, Thomas? I do not. Seniors, don't forget to turn your senior picture and letter to an aid to Mrs. Miller as soon as possible. LYI will be going to College of the Ozarks tomorrow. This Friday, there will be a regional star event at MSU. Next Friday is homecoming. Prepare your dresses, suits, or whatever you're wearing so you will be prepared and ready for homecoming. Can't wait to wear mine. On the 28th of January, there will be progress reports. Mine are looking pretty good. I hope <laughs> everybody knows. else's is. January 30th, Jocelyn's will be here to give sophomores their class rings. And now for your birthdays. Happy birthday to senior Caden Sams. Happy B day and have a great day. And also, in 1412, Joan of Arc. Roman Catholic Saint and National Heroine of France, born in 1431. That's all for your birthdays for now, now to sports. Welcome to sports. Great win last night, girls. Today, the boys will also begin the Spokane Tournament, and they will be facing the Galena Bears at 6. If the boys are successful, they will go on to play the winner of the Spokane Seymour game on Thursday at 8.30. However, if they fall short, they will play the loser of the Spokane Seymour game on Thursday at 5.30. If the boys win both games, they will also play on Saturday at 4.30 for first place. Let's hope they make it. Thursday, January 17th, the girls will travel to Fairgrove and play at 6, starting with JV and varsity following. Saturday, January 19th, the girls basketball team will also travel to Clever for a shootout against Neosho at 9.15, then against Carthage at 1. This will be JV only. Starting for your local news, Patrick Mahomes picked apart the Colts in his postseason debut. The Chiefs defense answered their chorus of critics for the stout performance, and Kansas City rolled to a 31-13 victory over Indianapolis in the divisional round. This Saturday, to end 25 years of playoff frustration, Mahomes threw for his 278 yards while running for a touchdown, and Damian Williams ran through snow and muck for 129 yards and another score. As the Chiefs beat Indianapolis for the first time in five playoff meetings to earn their first AFC title game appearance since January 19. Also, the Arkansas Department of Human Services says it will distribute February's food stamps benefits early as a result of partial government shutdown. The agency says those eligible for the Supplemental Nutrition Assistance Program, also known as food stamps, will begin receiving the February benefits on January 17th. DHS says this is not an additional payment and that recipients won't receive another payment until March if the program is funded by then. That's all for your local news. For your question of the week, what is your favorite Spirit Day outfit? My favorite Spirit Week day is definitely going to have to be Western Day. For today's Tasty Tuesday, we will be showing you how to make a chicken alfredo with only eight ingredients. Here's the video for that. That Tasty Tuesday looked delicious. I feel bad for anybody who wasn't paying attention. Thanks for watching. I've been Michael. And I've been Thomas. Don't forget, we aren't just the news. We're the news with Z. Have a great day.
Now I'm trying to run effect of the day. A group of frogs is called an army.